Hey, this is Sandy with our We Tennessee Homestead. So this is going to be a short video. I wanted to introduce you to our newest litter of rabbits. Um, we had a, uh, a doe that I had tried breeding a while back and she had put on some weight and she didn't take. So um, we decided that we were going to go ahead and even though I normally would not have bred her with Big Man, uh, we decided that we were going to go ahead and put her in the um, the penthouse suite with Big Man. He's got a, a big area that used to be our chicken uh, grow out pen. Um, lots of room to run and stuff. So we put, we put her in there with him about a month ago. And um, I knew that this week I would need to bring her out. Didn't know if she had bred or not, but wanted to make sure that if she did, that the babies were okay. So yesterday, we went to go pull her out of there so we could put her in a separate cage and um, get a nesting box set up for her and everything. And lo and behold, she had already looked in the, the big barrel where they have their little burrow, and she had already nested and had a litter of seven babies. So I kind of debated on what to do. I didn't want to leave her in there because bucks uh, are definitely known to kill babies. Um, so we went ahead and pulled her out. I'm going to show you what we got here. Um, so give me just a second. Okay, so we actually... Uh, <laughs> room is at a premium right now, so we actually had a cage we had just emptied out. Um, we didn't have a stand for it. There's no room in the bunker for it. So it's up on the porch. And this is Platinum. You've seen Platinum before. And she just got a treat of some dandelion greens and some violet greens, wild violet greens. And she's got... I don't know if it'll focus or not. She's got seven little squirmies back there. I don't want to take them out and keep them covered up. She's a good mama. Platinum's had several litters before. She's a very good mama. But um, anyway, I just wanted to introduce you to our newest litter. Um, we've got the blanket over this and the plastic just to keep out draft and cold. Um, it's not the ideal setup, but um, we, you know, you do what you got to do. And uh, Tim spent the last couple of weeks putting together a couple other cages, so um, we're uh, we're just doing what we can here um, until we get some rabbits sold and stuff. But um, anyway, so so. That's all I wanted to do, let you see our new babies, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. We appreciate you joining us, and uh, please hit the like and subscribe if you don't mind. Share if you think somebody else would um, enjoy our videos. Again, for those of you who are new subscribers, which I want to thank you so much. We, we were up to 145 subscribers the uh, last night when I looked, which is awesome. Um, I want to give you a big thank you. Um, you know we're we're not we're not the big fancy homestead we you know are we Tennessee homestead for those of you that haven't gone back and watched any of the other videos we're an acre and a half we uh, scrap cycle and try to do sustainable homesteading reusing and repurposing things and um, doing things on a budget because we're on a budget um, we are starting to put out more videos again since my health is getting better under control. And uh, I want to thank you guys, those of you that has, have stayed with us and um, held on till we could kind of get our act together again. So thank you so much. You guys have a blessed day. Remember to give, give thanks to the Lord for something. There's got to be something in your life that you can give thanks for. Um, our family motto is, in all things we give thanks. And um, I'd love for you to make that yours as well. You have a great day. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.